welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Sordo Ramirez says he tried to outbox Dimitri Bovol. And look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible. And, you know, Gilberto Sordo Ramirez has done a recent interview, according to BoxingScene.com, where he states he's learned a lot from his first career loss to Dimitri Bovol. And he also stated, look, I learned a lot from my first career loss against Bovol. Uh, he's a great fighter. I don't take anything away from him. He had a great night, and I didn't. The plan was to box him and step away from my usual forward fighting style. Now, this is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I mean, this officially makes him a dumbass. So the plan was to come in and box a pure boxer, an elite boxer, a guy with the best defense in boxing statistically, Dimitri Bavol. You thought you were going to come in and this guy is faster than you, has a higher ring IQ than you, and you wanted to box him. That was a moronic thing to say or even do. His whole team should be fired. He should fire his mama from being his parent because he's a dumbass. This is disgusting. He's a moron. He's a moron. And the only thing that he's learned is that he's going to go back to fighting weak competition like Gabe Rosado. That's the only thing this dumbass has actually learned. I mean, let's just be honest and unbiased about it. And then think about it like this. When you go back and look at the fight with Dimitri Bavol, you see him. What did Gilberto Sordo Ramirez do after the first six rounds? Remember, this was a shutout. Dimitri Bavol literally won every single round in this fight. So after you lost the first six rounds, what did you do then? What did you do then? After you lost the first six rounds, what did you do then? Not a damn thing. You kept getting your ass kicked. Under no circumstance were you beating Dimitri Bavol. You're not skilled. You're a hype job. You have no defense. And you have low IQ. You move slow. I mean, let's just be honest and unbiased about who this guy is. He's been cherry picking his whole career because he's never developed any other skill sets. Let's just be honest and unbiased because men lie, women lie, but the facts don't lie.